In this example, we will be explaining elements of definition and elements of usage. So with that, we'll get started. The first of two examples is going to be this block definition diagram with the internal block diagram. So this is our structural example. So what we're seeing here is our block definition diagram has a bunch of blocks on it with these connections between blocks, which are directed composition relationships. The blocks themselves are going to be elements of definition. The relationships between here, the directed composition, when you have this relationship, it actually creates a part property, which is an element of usage. And on your internal block diagram, your IBD, you will always see elements of usage. You will not see blocks on an internal block diagram. You will see part properties. So if you go over here to NASCAR, you can see left front, right front, left rear, right rear. These are all part properties that you, that you see on the internal block diagram. Left front, right front, right rear, left rear. So they're all wheels, which is your reusable block or element of definition. Elements of definition are reusable. And then part properties are the usage of that reusable element. So you can see your part properties in your containment tree, left front, right front, left rear, right rear, and they're all of type wheel. So moving on to our behavioral diagram, we have NASCAR again, and it would be the action of running a race. So we're not low on fuel immediately, the race is not complete, and then it will go in and do a lap. And you can do that as many times as you'd like until the race is complete, and then it's done. So just like blocks are elements of definition, activities are elements of definition. Just like part properties are elements of usage, actions are elements of usage. So things that are reusable, such in this case, lap, left turn, and pit, those are reusable elements. They will be elements of definition, while Turn one of type left turn is a type of element of usage. Same with turn two, turn three, turn four. These are all specific usages of the left turn. So I hope that helps give you two examples, one structural, one behavioral, explaining elements of usage and elements of definition. Thanks.